Yeah, that's the kid, Mikey Dollars, man. You watch that music on three. Mikey Dollars, what's up, man? What's the word, gang? Not much, man. Thank you so much for coming on the show. I appreciate it. I appreciate you, too. So, um, before we actually um, have you uh, perform your uh, big track, I just want to ask you a few questions before we start about, you know, you, where you come from, um, how you start and all that stuff. So, um, my first question is, uh, you being a Chicago artist living on the west side of Chicago, uh, what has been some of your obstacles that, that you've experienced personally coming up on the west side of Chicago and being an artist? <clears throat> Okay, um, see what a lot of people go wrong is I spent a lot of time growing up out south more. I lived out south more of my life than out west. I'm just from originally out west because I, you know, grew up right. out west when I was a little kid. Then I'm from, I've been out there every day. But even the days that I was on my block out west, I was still living out south. You know what I'm saying? And I was still out there too, so. Yeah, but yeah, I'm from uh, originally from Cermak and Colon. Okay, you know, I grew up over there. Then I um, actually moved from the west side to 64th and Drexel. Mm -hmm. So, but, um, as far as like being motivated through all this crap that we're going through right now, the pandemic and stuff, uh, I've talked to a lot of artists and I found that uh, a lot of artists they either hate it or they or it didn't affect them at all when it comes to like them being creative. How has that affected you? I mean, has it affected you or not? As far as like hate, I don't see no way you can hate it or love it. Well, I don't see no way you can love it. Yeah. Because some people getting sick and dying from it, you know, so right, ain't right. no way you can love death. But I know, understand some people probably, income is probably getting more better than yeah. what it was because there's so many scams out there now and so many, I'm basically just scams to me. Right. It's not even, they're not trying to help nobody to solve scams, you know, so, but. It really ain't affect me no way. It's you know I'm getting money still. You know what I'm saying, and I'm actually getting more money because it's people who 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 real fans of my music and they getting twenty k loans and they coming to spend it with me. You know, so it's I've like, heard that. I've yeah, heard about so people like, doing so that. I'm not. And I'm still waiting for mine. <laughs> <laughs> I'm still waiting on mine. Didn't get it yet. So you you created a lot of music, man. Like a lot, lot. Do you let me have like your favorite. Three, top three. Top three. Um, yeah. the um, out that jam with FBG Duck. Okay. Ill Will and being a black. That's it, that's the most views I got on a video ever. I think it's like two point five million, three million, wow. something like that. That's incredible. Yeah, I got a, um, another song called Mad Bitches. It's an older song, yeah. but I like it so much because I I actually talked about some females in this song. You know, who was throwing dirt on my name at the time. Uh, and then I actually did a song about some exes? it. Some <clears throat> exes? Yeah, some exes, some brothers, girlfriends. Okay, yeah, just hating. Yeah, yeah. So, and it's like, and they try to, they, they actually try to file lawsuits. Like a couple of them thought they was going to get some money off the song, you know. And the song uh, started going big, going to start going crazy for how me. How did that work? Did they, were, did they, they didn't get file? nothing. It ended up a dead end, yeah. you know. So, and I got, um the last one is probably, um, I got some called On The Plug too. And it's cause a lot of people just love that song so much. That's okay. a lot of fans favorite. Where can people find those? Find those I like find it on YouTube. You know, I got a lot of stuff on YouTube. All I gotta do okay. is type my name in on, on YouTube, World Star, Mikey that's what's Dollars. Up. That's what's up, that's what's up. So if, there, if you can name one artist that's from Chicago that you had a chance to, or would be able to perform with, who would it be? What you mean that's perform like on stage? Uh, yeah, like yeah. If there's an artist Man, out there that you can perform I, you with, know, I, you know, I okay. Did, let's say I not, not, not in Chicago. Let's say mm -hmm. in the states. Who who would you would be your ideal artist to perform with? Like as in the same show? Yeah. Or, to be honest, I really, I really don't too much care about other like major mainstream. I don't be right. You don't really, you, you don't come off it. You don't do the whole fan thing. I, it ain't even about because there's nothing wrong with being a fan. I right. just, I'm trying to get to the position there yet, so I'm not thinking right, about right. what they got going. I'm thinking about what I got going on. But I love doing, I love doing shows with the niggas I'm with. Right, Look, right. Chris. You know what I'm saying? I want to be with MIC. So, are there any artists out there that that are like hot right now that you actually look up to? I don't look up to nobody. What about inspire you? 
Lil Chris inspired me a lot. My brother yeah. Lil Chris, you know, we used to be in a group. That's um, what's up. MIC. Yeah, he inspired me a lot. Duck used to inspire me a lot too, you know, because he was getting big, big, and he was always a real nigga, you know. And you got to respect the nigga who blow and still look out for his peoples, you know what I'm saying? So right, right. it ain't really too many, too many like that. Well, what inspired you to write uh, I'm Better Than You? Um, A nigga, and it's crazy because I don't even know the nigga. Don't know the nigga from a can of paint, but he fuck with some niggas I fuck with. Me, okay. and, his, me and his people's cool, and he just and after a certain motherfucker, some shit happened, and nigga, I guess he done moved out the city, and right. some, a, couple, a couple of motherfuckers done died. Now he felt like I don't know what the fuck. I don't know what he may say my name for, but the nigga said my name. Said he robbed me and come out west and do this to me, and. He DM'd me though, like, no, nah, it's just I'm just rapping, bro. It's music. I fuck with you, like, you know. I, I'm like, no, you don't do that. That ain't the type of shit you say. And yeah. it's people. He got a little nice little fan base or whatever the case may be. It's people actually hit me up, like, damn, this nigga said your name for real, like, you know. So I just really did it for the art of music, really. You know, it wasn't really too much. But when I see him, I'm smacking him for real. I'm not even gonna say his <laughs> name. <laughs> 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 Oh, uh, that's tough, man. You know, I, I can totally see where you come from. Uh, it, it's I think one of the, I think the beefs in the industry can actually, uh, it doesn't really do anything good for for us. You know what I mean? Yeah, so nah. I really wish that artists would sort of like squash that. And I don't really, I don't do the beef thing. Yeah, I don't, I don't yeah, beef I ain't, I ain't got so. I, I know that, but yeah. there's a lot of guys out there that are into all that. But I think um, you think you can perform on better than you. Yeah, Tonight? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Most Let's definitely. Let's do it then. Most Let's definitely. Bye, bye. Let's take a nigga right out of the game, man. Let's get it. 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 Let's get Nigga, you can die trying to front your move. Take the air out your body like an inner tube. We can do this one on one just like an interview. Have a bitch to set you up, you swear that she was into you. And I don't give a fuck what you finna do. Have my shooter check you out the game if I ain't feeling you. That mean one false move, he'll be killing you. And them shots that a shooter nigga won't be healable. And them shots that a shooter nigga gon' be fillable. Clips gon' be refillable, your hood gon' be refillable, nigga. I make shit happen. One call from my phone, I get shit cracking. Been the leader since the shorty bitch, I been captain. And if I gotta up my pipe, my shit click clacking. Nigga, that's on a dead man's. Put a check up on your head like a headband. Nigga, I'm on the op side. 30 shots from this block to make a block high. Put my dick up on her nose and now she cock ass. Talking like you with it, you ain't with it till some shots fire. Nigga, yeah. I'm a great dame. I would take it off your neck, but that's a fake chain. I would let you kick it with me, but I hate lames. I would this and put you on, I'd rather take names. Yeah. I need mad now. You say my name to get some fame, let me find out. I got killers in that city that you hand out. Make them put that pistol in your mouth and blow your mind out. Nigga, you better ask folks. Tweaking with this rapper shit, gon' get your ass smoked. Tweaking with this rapper shit, you'll be a bad joke. Have them overdosing off these bullets like some bad coat. Have them getting cold from these bullets like a bad coat. Have his buddy itching like he watched it with some bad soap. Put you in a casket when your hood thought they had hope. Nigga, right when they had hope. You go for that shit the way you at. Stay where you at with that shit. Cause over here, you gon' get to